I wrote this concerto in 1989. The dedication is to Joe Hofbauer. He is a very good friend of me, so we know each other now for more than 30 years. We are getting older together, <laughs> and it's always funny with him. We laugh uh, at each tour we see, we meet. We laugh very often, and it's important to make this work. He played at my wedding, I played at his wedding. It was very funny because at my wedding, Guido has lost his score. <laughs> and it was very exciting because we had no music notes. Oh, we met the first time at school. We played together for 10 years and then we lost each other for some years and then we get back again in a, now in the orchestra. I am the chief conductor now for 15 years, more than 15 years, and he plays there our first trumpet. <laughs> this is a piece of my pastime. And uh, so I wrote like that 30 years ago, 25 years ago. So it changes a lot uh, now how the, the way of composing the style. But I'm more now a conductor um, looking at this piece. And uh, looking at the piece is not so overwhelming than playing with Joe. So the relationship, the musically relationship to Joe is very, much more deeper than the relationship from me to my comp composition. So my composition is past work. Uh, I'm looking at it as a conductor and I work on it as I work or as I would work on every other co composition. There's a little story about the first performance in Austria. It took place in Carinthia. My point of view is, he called me four days before the concert and said, I've broken my shoulder, my left shoulder. And I said, what are you doing? What did you, what? I, I can't find another trumpet player for that concert and nobody knows this music. I decided to play the concert. And so he, he came and he practiced it, but he played the whole concerto only with one hand and he was looking like that. Then he just... And the newspapers, on um, the day after the concert, they wrote in the headline, trumpet player, soloists, he played in the style of Miles Davis because I had my <laughs> trumpet down under. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was, I mean, for me, it was horrible. He did it very well, but he looked very strange. I tried to conduct this character and you tried to play the character. One, two, three. difficult to you uh, to be a conductor for your own pieces? Always. <laughs> this is, uh, these are your children, you know, this is always difficult. It's quite easier to, to conduct and work on pieces of other composers. Absolutely. Because every note you wrote 
is you, you you remember how you did it and why and and the decision was it okay was it not or did I write it in a quick way or did I think about that and I think a good example is when there is a, a composition by Franz Schubert called Der Lindenbaum. And everyone all over the world thinks that this is a folk song, but it is a composition by Schubert. That would be really great. If, if a composition is so well known that everyone can use it without knowing my name, it would be great. So I hope to be played. That's it, like ever composer, I hope to be played. Thank you.